guy, like they're going to be that one and kind of hope that at the draft to have a good ball right through and they're going to pick a spot. How much do you study roster to see what teams you should even look at and, and think of as possibilities? Um, I haven't really done that at all. I mean, I've, I've talked to coaches and kind of just gauge what they've said. And, I mean, they, you never really know because they can try to throw other teams off because they don't know if you, you know, uh, they want you or they don't want other teams to know that. So, um, I mean, we can't really do much. You just got to wait and see what happens. And once you get to the place, that's when you got to be able to turn it on. Are, are, they, are they giving you pretty honest feedback about what to improve on or what they like or where they might take you? Uh, yeah, I think they give me good feedback on what the what to improve on and what they like, like they've seen and stuff. Um, nobody's really said anything about draft stat and status or anything. You can't really get too caught up in that because um, you get Aaron Rodgers to try to go number one and you fall, so you never know. You just got to kind of play it by ear. And like I said, once you get there, that's when it really starts. Yeah, I think just because there's only one chance, maybe. Um, but it's more of probably a comfortable environment here. You're, you're in the McLean Center. You know, we worked out here for the past four years, so I mean, you're, and you're with all your friends. You don't. Know, I get the combine sometimes. You don't know who you're by. You don't. You know, uh, like some guy in front of you runs a four three, and you get maybe a little more nervous. But like everybody here, you know, you're comfortable in the setting, and uh, I think it's good. But the one chance kind of thing on is a, might be a little nerve wracking. Hey Joe, can you say? Real quick, you see the exact same people towards this way. Yeah. What was the question? <laughs> uh, well, no, 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 no. I guess the comparison between yeah. the combine and this. Oh, yeah. Um, I mean, definitely, just only having one shot at doing it in front of scouts would probably be more nerve wracking um, if you didn't go to the combine. But you are with, you're in the McLean Center where you've worked out for the last four years. You're with the guys that you know, you the guys you, uh, you like to hang out with. You know, nobody's a stranger, really, except for the scouts coming in. You kind of just got to put them on the side, focus on the one time. and. Hopefully not too bad. Where are you working at? Where are you spending more on I was in Orange County, California with Proactive Sports. They say you're supposed to be the highest projected badge in the NFL draft. Do you feel, I mean, do you know about that? Do you feel more pressure? Or we're expecting you to go one of the, I guess, third or fourth round or maybe? Uh, not really. Um, like I said, you can't really, I can't control any of that. I can't control where I'm going to get taken, how I'm going to take it. I'm going to get taken ahead of any of those other guys. Do what you do on the field. Um, one of the best you can out here and in interviews and talk to you. And just kind of put yourself out there, show them the real you, and hope uh, the chips line with it. Uh, about a five pounds heavier. Um, not like many massive increases. Just kind of working out, eating healthy, and having all my time just focused on doing that stuff. For like a few months. Can they ask you to look a little bit bigger? So I was wondering if scouts are kind of fishing around for okay inside, you know, your your attitude, your thoughts on inside versus outside versus whatever you get, get that sense. Yeah, I mean, they all, pretty much everybody asks me what I like, what, what they see me as and stuff. And various teams have different answers. So some like inside, some like outside, some kind of a little bit of both. So I think I can do any of them. That's what I tell them, and then they put you on the board and show you their scheme. And stuff. Do they, have, do they ask you questions uh, that are strange here at the pro day? Or are they, sometimes at the, at the NFL combine, there's some strange questions you get asked. But, uh, no, not really. I didn't get any strange. I didn't get any at the combine either. I think um, nobody really. But uh, I think it's more for some guys of questionable character or some like past events that they want to kind of just get a read on more. I didn't really have any of that. Can we control?